vs. Angelo Live, I'm Manny Diaz, and tis the season to cut down the nets. As the Eubanks coaching duo, along with the very best Lady Falcons, were looking to score the program's first ever trip to the regional tournament and had to get past Emily Sanderson and the Blackwell Lady Hornets first. First quarter, Lady Falcons, will they strike first? Zoe Bracher with a dime that's top of the line to the freshman Kennedy Wheelis. That'll do. A little later, following a Blackwell bucket, Catlin Ward to Bella Hoffman, very best, retakes the lead 4-2. Right around the three-minute mark, Blackwell answers with a Kylie Cummings three-ball, giving the Lady Hornets the 7-4 lead. Second quarter now, loose ball. Blackwell scores the handle and the quick pass to Emily Sanderson to go up 10-8. Lady Hornets would capitalize on that, taking a 14-9 lead into the locker room. Third quarter, Blackwell keeping the first half good times alive. Kylie Cummings earning 1-2-3 the hard way and one to make it 17-12 Blackwell. And here come the Lady Falcons and the three ball. Hello, Kennedy Wheelis to cut the lead to two. Fourth quarter now, very best chopping down that Blackwell lead. The sophomore, Chloe Herrera, buckets giving the Lady Falcons their first lead since the first quarter. But Herrera not done yet. Boom goes the dynamite for another big three ball. She was good for 11 on the night. Catlin Ward would add another triple to close things out. As the very best Lady Falcons take the dub 34 to 29 and are headed to the regional tournament for the first time in program history. Nonetheless, tonight was about how Chloe Herrera got her groove back. It's so hard to beat somebody three times in a season and you know we came out and we just fought and clawed and it wasn't very pretty but we finally found a couple of strokes when it counted and, and it was huge. We went into the locker room and he told us we need to calm down. We were panicking basically, we were nervous and we came out here and we played how we usually play. You know, Chloe's been struggling lately with her shot and she, she came up to me before the game tonight and she said, Coach, I found my shot. I found my shot. And I just hugged her while ago. I said, sweetheart, I sure am glad you found that shot. Because, I mean, at that time, it was just, like you say, nobody could get any traction. I just got my flow. My feet were good. Let it off. 